And all my love had been locked away And your heart was the key Textiles is the go-to brand for the coolest and softest Texas shirts. It is a family-owned and brand business started by two high school teachers that love to support local and the great state of Texas. A portion of their sales is donated to help scholarship graduating seniors. Tumbleweed Textiles' goal is to outfit every proud Texan with their unique hand-drawn designs. You better go check out their Texas goodies at www.shoptwt.com. Use coupon code LOCALLIVE for 20% off today. We're here, Texas Local Live. I'm your host, Ben Martinek. To my le left, your right, Kelvin Thomas. How you doing, Kelvin? I'm all right. I'm all Good right. Good to see you, man. Brother. Thanks for coming out Absolutely. tonight. We're here at the ranch in Las Colinas. We had some music. We're kind of flipping the script tonight. We had some music first, having a couple interviews, and a little sit-down chat here. We're at the national championship going on, so people are trying to listen to that game going. Yes, but uh, we don't care about that right now. We're right. hanging out. We're chatting. <laughs> we're hanging out, doing a thing. Man, I will say, I'm gonna, I, I like to start every show, preface it with what got you into music? What got you going? You mentioned earlier you're new to this, but tell yeah, us yeah. what got you started, man. So, uh, in high school, 2011, it was, it was girls, essentially. Okay, easy I, enough. I, I started playing guitar because I didn't have a girlfriend, and I thought that This'll is the it. perfect <laughs> way to get a girlfriend, but it um, hasn't worked out, gladly. Um, oh, okay. So, uh, gladly, I like yeah. that. <laughs> <laughs> So that got you into it, man. That was yeah. it. So you did, were you writing originals out of the gate, or were you just doing covers? You're like, oh, this is, this is what the girls like right So here. it started as covers. I was covering people like Coldplay and uh, John Mayer and mm -hmm. John Legend, like that crowd. And uh, Cool. Yeah, man. Uh, but yeah, recently it's been mostly just kind of like trying to stay on that track of playing all originals yeah, on all my sets. Yeah, sure. so. You yeah, gotta start I mean, somewhere though. You can't absolutely. rhyme I mean, unless you're just a savant. You're writing originals out of the gate absolutely. and you just got it down. But yeah. yeah, man. So you, um, when you were you teaching yourself guitar, or, I mean, you're a fantastic guitar player as well. I must Thank say. You. So yeah. Well, I can say is uh, my my tenth grade teacher, uh, he taught me G C A minor D, mm. right? And I, I like went, it. Yeah, went from there. Uh, my older brother, he he started playing some. One day I just heard him playing some jazz uh, jazz chords, and I was uh, like, oh, I want that. Yep, so, that'll get you. Uh, and so that's – and I've, I've kind of been able to mix the two to make a not, – not exactly a unique style, but just a style that isn't way too mainstream. So Yeah. yeah no, you, you definitely have – I can hear that jazzy chords you're kind of rolling with. And it's all – it's – I play guitar, so I, yeah. I'm watching your fingers a little bit, and I'm seeing you're kind of really doing – a standard C, but you're doing some little flares with other fingers that most don't do, and Absolutely. it really accents with your voice, and it's a really cool Thank thing. Thank you, brother. We're running sound, and the first thing he says is, I need the bass lowered, and I yeah. need my mids and highs, you know, whatever, yeah, yeah. Eight, whatever, and you're just kind of, and to know your EQ is a huge thing, man. Oh, I mean, yeah. you're able to know your sound. That's, I mean, you're giving yourself an advantage right out of the yes, gate. I don't, I mean, I don't know you until you start playing, so right. that's a really cool thing to do. When did you start uh, doing that? I know it's a side, little bitty thing, but... Oh, you when start I, EQing yourself. Like, when did you start to notice, like, oh, I, I'm good in these ranges, I'm good in these frequencies? So when it came to my voice, I've, I've always been this little, like, just real bassy dude. Yeah. And so I had to, I had to start bringing up my, my, my highs and my yeah. mids. And I, I figured that out one day. I had to do a show on my own. I didn't have anybody working sound. And I was like, man, oh. like, my, my voice, you can't, yeah. you can't hear me articulate anything. Yeah, and so, dead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so I... Just tweaked it. Just, I was yeah. Like, yeah, and so and uh, that's how I know now. That's cool. Yeah. <laughs> no, I mean I know it's simple. It's very elementary, but I still am just you know it's a lot of artists don't do that, man. It's yeah, it's man. just a little thing, and you're like, oh, the sound guy will get it, or sound girl will yeah. get it, whatever. It's it, they won't until I mean they yeah. will at some point, but yeah, a good yeah. one will. But uh, yeah, man, I'm much appreciative. Of that. <laughs> I definitely appreciate definitely that understand. a lot. So you uh, you've been not playing very long. You you said you about a year, year and, and a half. few months, year and a half. Yeah. We'll call it okay. Yeah, yeah. Um, t tell us a little bit about what you've gotten into in terms of shows, maybe, in terms of exposure. Uh, you've been playing Dallas area mostly, yeah? Um, yeah, uh, all Dallas area. Uh, trying to grow my name here since my main motivation is uh, Leon Bridges. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> good the way follow, he did man. it, it was just, the way he did it, man, was just kind of, 
I don't know. It, I don't want to call it luck, you know. <laughs> I don't want to call it luck when they're when God exists. So <laughs> yeah. So uh, the man was blessed, and I'm I'm thinking, man, I can do the exact same thing. And I I met him one time, and he uh oh cool. He uh and I he had a, like a secret show, and I was like, hey man, you want to open up for me? I said, do I want to open up for you? Absolutely. So hey. I opened up for him that night, and uh, he he wrote in my songwriting book. He said, keep pushing. And I have that tattooed on my arm now. So Really? Yeah, Very man. nice. Tell so, us about that show, man. That's a really interesting uh, breakthrough. So there were like five people. That's amazing. There were five dude. people at this show. It was me, my buddy, Leon, and a couple of other people. Um, and uh, he was like, uh, and it was funny. I was actually supposed to cover River that night, hmm. and I didn't because I didn't finish learning the song. And uh, gladly, because I wouldn't have done it justice yeah but um yeah he was like hey you want to want to open up i have a few songs and uh i was like i mean i'm not gonna say no right yeah <laughs> you so, cannot say no to that right. i don't care if you're playing mary had a little lamb over and over, and over right again. <laughs> yeah you're doing it man you're absolutely going. that's yeah, amazing man. dude so you just kind of don't want to say luck luckily right fell into that yeah, I'm a, um, I'm a proponent of luck. I'm not, I, and you can call it blessed or luck. Right, but right. I think they're the same thing in my book. Because if you have that faith and you have that thought in your heart, I, I think it's very much a Show internal enough. soul thing. Right. You know, it, it, whatever you call it, it's uh, it's the universe speaking to you right. in some way, shape, or form. So same thing, know, different name. Thing. Exactly. Thank yeah. you. It doesn't matter. It's just the English language, man. It's a confusing thing. I'm whatever. I'm not about that, but. So you you got into that show. That's pretty amazing. Yes, sir. And so since then, I mean, I'm sure that spark. Obviously, you got it on your body. It's in it's in ink on you. Yeah, man. And uh, it means something to you. Yeah, yeah. So when he when he actually when he said when I saw it when he when he wrote it in there, I was like, man, that is, it was super timely because I was kind of being discouraged, uh, along with my my musical endeavors. Mm -hmm. Not much was going on, uh, and I was like, man, what am I what am I gonna do? You know, and. Uh, yeah, and then he told me just keep pushing, man. And I was that was like that's all I needed. It was weird. Yeah, no, it's crazy. Then, uh, that's really cool. Yeah, man. It just it hit was, you. It's awesome. Timely Leon Bridges. I'll Look tell you this, man. <laughs> I'm just I'm blown away. That's a yeah, really, man. really cool thing. That's a story you will take to the grave with you, man. That's Absolutely. just amazing. That's so cool. Yes, sir. Not as a secret. So I guess that, right? see that phrase, <laughs> that turn of phrase. I just mean he's gonna have it the rest of his life, but okay. Right. <laughs> see. English. No one like. What's up with English? <laughs> no one. No one digs it. So, uh, as a, uh, I'll call you young and upcoming yeah. artist here. Mm -hmm. Tell us some uh, perspective of, I guess, the Dallas scene. You've kind of been up yeah. here. Tell us a little bit about that and kind of what you've come across in your um, own experience. I can say, um, and honestly, I, man, um, as a as a believer, you know, uh, the Dallas scene. It's it's awesome, and, and and it's and it's. Some say it's hard yeah. to make it. You know what I mean? But yeah, it's 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 not it's not hard at all. Uh, like I man, I I love God absolutely, and and when I say He has been the absolute powerhouse to my career, and absolutely, in absolutely every aspect, dude. I mean, He has just been coming through, just nonstop lately, and it's kind of, and I and I. Part of it was kind of like being here, man. You know, I uh, I don't know. I, I connected with you guys on Instagram, and then yeah. I was kind of like, ah, all right, connected with them. So I'm just gonna gonna continue to do what God tells me to do, and uh, hit me up on Instagram, and now I'm here, man. And that's someone drop. Yeah, God's been good we a long time. Someone. Absolutely, you came through. Absolutely, it all worked. I mean, it's it's. Case in point, right here. Yeah. If you're not, I mean, if you're not <laughs> believing in any of this, I mean, yeah. this is it. This is in the flesh. Absolutely. We're sitting here talking, and we, the reason you're here is for that reason. I Absolutely, mean, that's, man. That's that's heavy, man. And then that's that's the truth. And you have a talent. Thank it you. It came brother. from something. Oh I yeah. Mean, someone, something gave you that. Someone yeah, gave you that. Some. Absolutely. You know what I mean? Uh, it's it's uh, it's fascinating what you've done, man. And I do dig your style a Thank lot. You, and you've and, you, and like you said, you were you've been playing. How long have you? You said 2011 is when you've actually been. Uh, honing your craft. Let's playing say. guitar, yeah. Playing guitar mm -hmm. since 2011. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you're playing like you've been doing it longer than that, which, and your presence up on stage is is pretty incredible, man. I mean, Thank tonight, you, man. The, the energy's, it's been a little slow tonight, yeah. man. We got the game going, everyone. But yeah, yeah. you were like nonstop 
next song. I'm ready. Let's go. And yes, you sir. just killed it. Thank it's you, amazing, brother. man. I really, I'm that. really appreciate. I'm glad we had you on because uh, I like, I like to see some, uh, some fresh faces up here, Absolutely, man. I really man. love it, man. That's yes, just sir. been great. So, do you have any uh, aspirations to break out of Dallas, man? What do you think you got coming up in 2019, for example, fresh year? So, uh, <laughs> people will get tired of me, but uh, <laughs> once again, man, I, I'm just, I'll just refer back to God. Like he, wherever He calls me, I will go. If He calls me to the middle of the desert. I'll go. If he calls me to the top of Mount Everest, I will go. So literally, man, I'm telling you, when it <laughs> here's the thing. So when when you stop uh, viewing God as a resource and start seeing him as a source, that's when things actually start changing. When you see him as your career, when you see him as your money, as you see him as someone who's going to, you know, just uh, just bring you up, you know, and that's that's my thing, man. As soon as I stopped looking inwards to advance myself and I, and I started realizing who's given me the breath of my lungs and the one who's given me the ability to walk, the one who's given me the ability uh, to play guitar, the one who gave me the muscles in my fingers to play guitar. To what like you do, that's, yeah. that's, that's when everything changed for me, man. Like it's been, it's been an absolute journey and I cannot be happier. That's awesome. I man. cannot be happier. Your faith is incredibly strong. I mean, Thank is you, your brother. family, I mean, I'm assuming family's got something to do, or did you just go out on your own and build it? So I'll say it wasn't by my own accord, for sure. Uh, my brother, he kind of, he was the one, his name's Ladrell James. Uh, my brother, he was the one who actually kind of drove it into me because I started seeing his life and, and his life and his family and how much, like his faith, and then seeing that faith being rewarded by. Like, dude hasn't had, a, like, an actual, like, like a day job in 26 years. Hmm. You know what I mean? And he's, he's been married for 12, and he's got four kids. And somehow, man, they are, they are, they are not, only, they're not only surviving, but they're thriving, man. They're thriving mm-hmm. and they're growing because of their faith. And, like, for me, that was kind of like, all right, so you don't have a choice anymore. Yeah. You, you, you've seen it at work, so yep. what are you going to do now? You're going you're gonna to look dead at it or turn away from it. You yeah. know what I mean? That's very, very interesting. Yeah, man. Well, thanks, Claiborne. Hey, you can throw me one of these uh, koozies, too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I, have to, I have to at least mention them because they help right, yeah. us. They love Absolutely. us. Absolutely. I will mention the ranch. We are at the ranch if I didn't already. The ranch, but, uh, We love them, yeah. Have the chicken fried steak. If you I don't, saw you eating that. Oh. Have the chicken fried steak. Extra gravy. Mm. Do it. See, I'm hungry. I haven't gotten to eat yet, man. I get off work. <laughs> I get up here. I start doing the show. And I'm like, man, I'll get, I start eating late at right. night. It's not good. Yeah. Oh, i got to change my habits. 2019. I oh, yes, sir. Going. Yeah. So tell us uh, a little bit about, do you have stuff online, social media side? Or how can we find you if we're oh, not yeah. here? Yeah. So uh, Instagram, you can find me at Kelvin, K-E-L-V-I-N, underscore, underscore, Thomas, T-H-O-M-A-S. Uh, yeah. And uh, I'm releasing an EP in February. Nice. February 4th called The Love EP. Uh, two songs uh, that I wrote a long time ago. Oh, finally putting good. them out there. Uh, you can also find me on Facebook at Kelvin Thomas. And it also should be, co- my Instagram should be connected with my Facebook. So, uh, yeah. Okay, very yes, cool. Sir. Where you uh, record the EP at? I'm, rec- <laughs> I'm recording the EP in uh, my buddy's uh, lofts. Cool. And uh, in close to deep Ellum, yeah and uh like this for some reason his loft has this beautiful beautiful sound like this natural reverb that's oh that's amazing know, makes me makes me feel good that, in here. hey <laughs> man if you feel good you're gonna play good and that's all yes, that matters sir. that is all that matters yes sir and it will translate to the Absolutely. listener for sure well kelvin i appreciate you chatting with us man. i really appreciate man. your music you really do have a talent Thank i you, hope brother. to have you back that. here uh, actually we'd love to have you back after the ep release or maybe during that time february Absolutely. about a month or so so yes sir you're linked up with us. We're going to find yes, you. Sir. Someone's going to find us. I sure appreciate you, brother. Kelvin, thank yes, you sir. so much. Go find him. Go follow him. Let's get this going with thank this you, guy. Thank you. And thank you guys for watching. Uh, check us out if you haven't seen our YouTube stuff. And uh, listen to this guy play if you haven't already. It's probably the next video on this <laughs> in, the next, <laughs> in the side here, hopefully. But thank you for hanging out, and uh, you, we'll see you all next time.
lost my wits when I heard love knocking at your door. Are you so? It started screaming at the top of its lungs. We were so high strong. But expectation and hesitation. Pursuit of a fool, you know why? Was a fool for you? Was a fool for you? No, your mind showed me places that I couldn't see. Send me free. And all my love had been locked away. And your heart was the key. Oh, you got me. But expectation. Shoot of a fool, you know why? Was a fool for you. And they say Rome wasn't built in a day. This ain't wrong. 